have an awesome footwork. A great portion of Lomachenko's game is all about gaining the advantage of angles on his opponent, and he uses his footwork to achieve them. The dramatic angles that you see Loma getting to are from front and back step shuffles. Let's get to it. At the highest skill level in boxing, these fighters have reasoning behind most every movement. Here, Loma is pre-slipping or changing head slots and then changing levels. Both movements have multi-purposes, but they are both especially feints and slips. The head slot change to the right gets the head off center line, brings the backhand closer to the op, and loads Loma's lead side. The level change lowers the op's target and can also load the back leg and of course it's a precursor for a possible body strike from Loma. Watch the op ignore the head slot change but react to the level change by backing off and how Loma watches and adjusts and or reacts accordingly. wants to keep it clean and definitely doesn't want an inside fight so when his op comes inside to clinch or smother it's a frame and push every time.
is usually in attack mode, but if he wanted to be defensive, stick and move like a pure boxer, he could easily be one of the best. I don't know how many times I've talked about high level fighters retreating to a high guard just to entice a strike to counter it. If you fight, just add it to your game. At this point, Loma has added a lead too to his head slot change and his level change, noticing the op hasn't been reacting to either. Fancy, looks like the boys on skates. In the open stance, aka southpaw versus orthodox, the inside foot position aligns the jab while the outside foot position aligns the backhand. Cracks a 
smile right here. Great hand-eye coordination. I know he trains with the ball and headband. exactly what he was looking for out this one-two low faint. It's downhill from here.